Hi, this demonstration is to show you how to set up a time clock. Okay, in our training case here, we have two load controllers and two panels as we know. One of our load controllers has a time clock in it though. I can tell which one has the time clock by clicking on each of them and one of them will have an icon up here of a clock. That icon is to set the time clock's time. So we can click on that icon and then it will open up this window and you can see here that in this case I'm happy to set the time by synchronizing to my laptop. Once you have set the time, go to the tasks and events tab on the time clock. In the real world, the time clock would exist in your project as its own device in the tree structure of the network view. Open your tasks and events tab and click on edit. Here you can see on the event editor that we have two example events. They are set to be disabled by default, but you can enable them by clicking this box. Give your event a name and then set the days and months that you want the event to run. You can set the time to whatever you please, absolute time or before or after sunrise or sunset. Set the parameters for the message that you want to send at that time. In this example I am sending a dummy message at sunrise and sunset which is going to trigger a task which will live on another panel. If you need more events, then you can click on add as many times as you like there. Now if you click on the text editor tab, you can scroll down to the bottom here and you can see all of your code in text format. If I scroll all the way up to the top, then I can see where it is getting the sunrise and sunset information from. You can set that information by going to Tools, Set Location and Time Zone, or you can edit it directly in the event file by typing it into the EVT.